but yeah, I know nothing. It's an indie game. I think it's just the one person who made it. It's spooky. It's got a fox man demon puppet animatronic thing chasing you. And uh, let's find out if I get spooked or not. A uh, new game. Medium. I've been told it's difficult. And by told, I heard it's difficult from someone else playing it. To play this game, you need headphones. Hi, uh, is... Oh, oh, oh. What did I miss? What did it say? Oh, balls. Uh, please let me know if I need to turn down any audio at some point if I need to turn up my mic. I know nothing. I don't know if this is a puzzle game or if it's just like a, a chase simulator or what. Here we go. Okay. Uh, inspect the office. Okay, I don't hear anything. Oh, I do. It's very quiet. I am concerned. Oh, it's so quiet. Oh, it's so quiet. I have to turn the game audio up again. I can't crouch. Can't jump. I can't run. Oh, shit. Oh, no. I'm not ready for this. Can't go there. Oh, fuck. What hellscape are we in? One? I don't know what the fuck's going on. I can't do anything but walk. More cameras. Hello? Oh, I don't like this. You're not joining the homies would be kind of sus. Find the noise? Oh, bitch. This is going against, like, my every survival instinct. It's like a rumble? Oh, bitch, this is such a bad idea. Why did I do this? Oh my god. Where am I supposed to go? I don't know where to go. Oh fuck. Oh fucking shit. Okay. There's some sort of uh, foxy wolf thing. Uh, what does this mean? Also, there's a bit of an echo. One second. Probably the attacker is also looking for this envelope. Okay. Um. So some sort of monsters experiment escaped. Okay. How's that? Oh, I can see now. Okay. So that was found footage. Got it. How to play. Oh, can you stay up on screen for me? Your task is to listen carefully to which part of the house the monster is running to so that you can close the window in time. To close the window, hold the E key. I fucking hate this. Can I run? Oh, bitch, it is like- Oh, that's exactly what this is. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. I saw him too. Oh, I don't like this, dude. Oh, I don't like this. Oh no. Okay. Fuck, go upstairs, go upstairs, go upstairs. Am I too late? Oh, bitch. Oh, I don't like this at all. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, he's there. Oh, I'm not gonna do well at this game. He, I think he killed me. 
I don't know what to do. Oh, bitch. Hit the door, hit the door, hit the door, hit the door, hit the door. I'm hitting E! Hello? Oh, it's it's busted. Oh, it's busted. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I'm gonna turn up the audio a little bit. So we can all hear him stomping around. It's like, oh, she shut up, dude. Fuck, it's open. No, don't be in the house. Don't be in the house. Oh, he's already in here. He's already in here, dude. How? I need to lower the difficulty. This is crazy. He just fucking waltzed on in here. There's nothing I can do. Yep, hi. Why won't it close? Am I doing something wrong? Okay. Here's a quick rundown, because I failed this part of the game for like an hour. This level should not have taken me an hour to figure out. Here's the rundown. There is a distinct noise when the monster goes from one floor to another. At the start of the level, he will be on the first floor. When he transitions to the second floor, you'll hear a very distinct sound. You'll hear this sound. That means you need to go upstairs, otherwise you won't be able to hear him properly. You can only really hear him on the floor that he's on. So if you're downstairs and you didn't hear the audio cue to go upstairs, you're not going to be able to find him in time. And if he's going downstairs, you'll hear this noise. You hold the window close until you hear a beep. The beep will tell you it's safe. Also, when the door first opens, like when he's first trying to open the window, you'll he also hear a beep. You have to hold E! You have to hold the button to keep the door closed, otherwise he'll kill you. If the door isn't closing, it's because he's already inside. You already failed. If you hear a short circuiting sound, that means you need to hold the door longer than usual. My best advice is to stand in the middle of the floor uh, and stay there and consistently face the same direction. That's it. That's all you gotta know. Hopefully that helps. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it, dude. You're a quick one. He's a fast boy. He's fast as fuck, boy. We're fine. Everything's fine. Hold E for Wumbo. Hey, how you doing? Okay. It takes him two sprints to get to one side on the f on the bottom floor. Or maybe it's just two audio cues on the bottom floor. He's not chunky, he's just tall as fuck. He's a fucking tank. Hey, we're doing it though. I'm gonna be a master by the time I'm done with this fucking game. Hold it longer. Hold it longer. Long press. Okay. Heavy footed. Heavy footed as fuck. Alright. 
Just hold it longer. We're fine. We're good. We're good. My poor E button is getting getting a workout. Oh, he's on the floor. No, he's not. He's back up. I got juked. Okay. He's on the floor again. Okay, I know the cue for jumping down now. He's up again. Oh my god, you're such a dick. He's such a dick. Pick a side, babe. Pick a side. I feel like the crab from Moana. Pick an eye, babe. Pick an eye. Ooh, I got it, dude. I got it. I understand now. I understand now. <sighs> I'm up again. I feel like the crab from Moana. Pick an eye, babe. Pick an eye. Ooh, I got it, dude. I got it. I understand now. I understand now. <sighs> I'm up again. I got your number, bitch. It's over. I understand now. I know the audio cues. I got your number. I know your bullshit. Let's go, baby. Let's go. He's on the ground. Up again. On the ground. Got your number, bitch! You sure you don't want to up the difficulty now? No. I'm good, thank you so much, though. Okay, we're good. Oh, I got you. I fucking got you! Let's go! How much longer? How much longer? The suspense is making it really hard to hear. Woo, baby, let's fucking go, dude! Finally! I did it! According to our data, the son and father of Subject 88 live in this house. The father is currently away. As everyone knows, Representatives of the Brevis Homo race have a small stature, thanks to which the son of Subject 88 managed to leave without leaving any traces. After a search of the house, the same prints were found as in the infamous archive. Apparently it was the same killer. After analyzing the phone calls, 
We found out that a certain citizen living in the Artacticon district called this house the other day, before our arrival. Okay. It was clear from the style of communication that they knew each other. They were talking about the same envelope that Subject 88 left. Oh, he sent you. At the end of the conversation, they agreed to meet. It's a sentient being. I thought it was just like a an animal, you know? Oh, fuck. Find number 17, 17, 17, 17. Aha! Find apartment number 17, okay. 16, 2, 5. Well, that was just like the tutorial. Which is great. I'm so excited for that. Oh, hi, Bubba! Um... Hi! Thanks for not killing me. Seventeen. Thanks for not murdering me. Oh no, it's so much more difficult. What am I looking for? I feel short. Am I short? One, two, three. Yeah. Buddy, can you hear me? Yeah. I hope so. I apologize for not being able to meet you in person. I have my own reasons for this. I really hope you have the envelope. Your father risked everything to prevent this envelope from falling into the hands of the Collectionarium. Or even worse, into the hands of the creature that is now on your tail. Don't worry. He won't be able to get into this apartment. I've taken care of that. Are you sure about that? The most important thing to remember is one thing. Do not open the envelope in any case. This can lead to sad consequences not only for you, but also for everyone around you. It's a secret. We have too little time. I have no right to detain you. Take this walkie-talkie. I'll help you from time to time. Okay. Thanks, buddy. Is that like a shock collar? You can find a train ticket in the next room. It will take you to the right place. Or is it like a com when you arrive at your destination? Hmm. I'll contact you again. Like a communication device for like the creature? Is it on the table? On the well, check for tickets on the table in the other room. Uh I see no such tickets. Oh, radio dude is crazy. Got it? Got it? Got it? Got it. What does the book say? Oh, I, I wanted to read the bloody book. At least try to. What game? Spooky game. <laughs> trying to make it sound scary. All the data on this case was transferred to the collection area because of our incompetence in this matter. Its name is Weedy Hut Juniors. <laughs> it's like, okay. Okay. Uh, your task is to prevent the monster from getting in the apartment complex to do so. You, you need to carefully monitor the movement of the monster and close the door in time or exit the complex in a timely manner. The compartment you'll need to enter will be highlighted to close the door or exit uh, you need to press the key that appears on screen it is extremely important uh, to monitor the movement of the creature because otherwise the key will not appear on your screen so it's oh fucking god I have to learn new mechanics dude okay don't let the monster in you need to carefully monitor the movement of the monster close the door in time or exit the compartment in a timely manner so like it's we're hiding as well like alien uh the compartment you need to enter will be highlighted to close the door you need to press the key that appears on screen fucking quick time events oh fuck me all right locked 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 what? Yeah. 
Confused? Oh, the light's on. Okay. Do I have to hold it closed? I'm so confused. T! Oh, do I have to, I have to hold T? Damn it. What does Q and E do? Okay, I'm confused, but we'll figure it out. Okay, whatever light turns on is the room I need to go into. Got that. Okay, F. I have to watch the windows and the fucking door? This is so brutal. Okay, he's this side. Okay, he's in front of my door. Okay. Fuck you. When can I let go? When can I leave? Hi! What the fuck am I supposed to do there? Get the fuck out of the room, maybe? I don't know how to exit, I guess T? Or F? Inside. Oh no. What does that mean? I can't leave. I can't get out of the room. It won't. It won't let me leave. Oh, Lord. <sighs> He's definitely outside. On the window. I didn't see the quick time of it. I'm an idiot. Fuck. I don't know how to make the key appear. I'm getting indigestion out of fear. Fear indigestion. It was F. I pressed T. They changed the button on you, dude. It is this difficult. It's somehow harder. Where this level is more difficult. God, I can't talk. How do I make the key appear? Uh, is extremely to a model because otherwise the key will not appear. Fuck. But if I'm looking at the window, I'm screwed. So am I supposed to look at the window at all, or no? I almost fat fingered that key too. Fuck, dude, what am I supposed to do? T! Oh, it's T! It's T! Let me out! Oh! Oh! Bitch! Okay, you have to. What is. You just gotta turn around. Oh! Oh, the clinch, dude. Balls. Oh, you hoe. Ah! Oh, my God. 
Holy shit. Hold a fucking SpongeBob. Hi, how are you? Jesus Christ. No, I pressed the wrong button. No. I pressed R instead of T. I panicked. God damn it. I can do this. I can do it. A wrong button. God damn it. God fucking damn it. I hate that it's a quick time event. I, why can't it be the same damn key? Why must you test my hand-eye coordination, you bitch? Mr. Fox. You're not even that fantastic. Hi, F. Goodbye. Later, bitch. Okay. We're down to 200 seconds. Always wanted to ride on a train. I mean, I've been on subways. I don't think that counts, though. Trains are cool, though. Very, uh, atmospheric. I feel like I'd sleep really well on a train. I like hearing, like, some sort of white noise while I fall asleep. That is true. Falling asleep on a train if you're tall would be a, a problem. I don't know. I'm 5'8". I fit in most places. This wants to be taken to Hogwarts. Honestly, I rather... Like, my childhood dream was to be in a dragon rider because of Aragon. Like, Harry Potter was cool, but I didn't really get into Harry Potter till I was a little bit older. I was already a, a teenager when I started watching Harry Potter. Hi! Doo -doo -doo. What door do we go to? 184 seconds. There she is! Yep. I can't give the doggo treats. There's no more treats. There's nothing to give. Hi! Hi! I find this level a little bit easier because it's it's one or the other, you know? Left or right? Hey, you this side. Got it. You're in the room, I understand. Big boy. Now you're outside. Definitely outside. Inside. Oh, you're running. Oh, he running. Here come that boy. Open the door, boyo. Do it. Do it. Balls, 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 balls. Nope. 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 Not today, sir.
I'd hold that for a while. Oh, no! No! I pressed the wrong button, dude! My dyslexia! I hit F instead of T! Oh, bitch. Oh, bitch. Oh, bitch. Eep. Let's go. Finally, dude. Two levels down. Oh, my God. It's so difficult for me. The struggle. ¿Qué pasó? Uh, más o menos. Um, I'm struggling with the horror game. Check three, two, one. There's a security post to your right. The door should open soon. Oh, thanks. Am I gonna get spooked in the meantime? There it is. Can you close the door for me? Thanks, buddy. Do you see the generator? Activating it will open a large gate. There won't be anyone inside. I've taken care of that. We can only hope that this creature has lost you. So, the drawings indicate that four generators will be waiting for you inside. Okay. After they are turned on, the gate to the disintegration room will open. Disintegration? You'll have to take this envelope there. And after you go inside, I won't be able to help you anymore. Great! You'll have to do everything yourself. The main thing is, don't worry. Everything will be fine. See, I don't know about that. I don't know if I can trust you. Good luck, buddy. This is a generator? Okay. Uh, let's go! Ah! <laughs> Bad fox. I got spooked. Oh, my heart. Oh no, it's another design. No, no, not another level. Your task is to activate four generators. After the activation, the big door will open. The only way to survive the, uh, when encountering the monster to shine the flashlight in his face. Uh, turn on F and hold down F. If you release the flashlight before it's turned on, uh, it will temporarily fail. To sprint, hold shift. Okay. One down. Nothing here. <laughs> Shit, he's quick. Okay. Um... Bitch. Fuck, dude! What am I supposed to do? God damn it. I gotta learn. This is the one thing I don't really like about this game is I have to relearn the rules every fucking time. Hold F. If you release the flashlight button before it turns on, it will temporarily fail.
what is the light supposed to do? Do I have to hold it on them a certain amount of time? Like, what's what's going on with that? Does it just slow him down and I have to run anyway? And you only have so much battery life, too. Oh, that sucks. I don't know what to do once I stun him. I guess run. I guess. I don't know. Like, what am I doing wrong there? Like, you, the, the game doesn't tell me what I'm doing wrong. Do I have to sprint away after I stun him? Do I have to just hold the light on him? Like, what's what am I doing here? Go away! Go away! Oh, he, okay, there he goes. Okay. That is such a long time to hold it to him. Holy shit. Okay. Here come that boy. Here come that boy. I'm waiting for you. Okay, he ran. Good, good, good. Did end. Did end. Listen here, you bitch boy. Don't come back. You hear? This is not the place to be. I need to be quick. Here he comes. Fuck, 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 fuck. I'm stuck. I'm dead. Nope, 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 nope. Fuck you. I don't have much battery life left either. Oh, she got no sprint left. Where's the last one? Fuck. Oh, I might have passed it already. I don't know where it is. Now what? Where do I go? Back to the start, okay. I don't know where I started. Here. This is where I started! No! I don't know where to go. I'm dead. Fuck, I don't know. <gasps> there it is. Go, you bitch. Oh, thank God, dude. I thought it was done. What is this? There's more? Oh, bitch. Hi. If 
furry. What's up, dude? You can hear me too. Yeah, I love your fursona, man. It looks great. Um. You're my older brother? Ah, oh, fuck. If you didn't try to kill me every two seconds, I would have found out. Oh. Are you actually my brother, or is it like a hypothetical? Okay, you're gonna eat me, aren't you? I don't know if I could trust you, man. Furries are usually cool dudes, but I feel like you're the exception. gonna eat me dude you're gonna eat me hi <laughs> yoink to me dude what now what happens now am i dead is it over game over i think those there's two endings i guess he murdered me <laughs> understandable Fair enough. <laughs> I thought I could trust you. I thought we were cool. Liar. <laughs> He's giving the itties what it is. <laughs> he just hit me with the itties what it is, dude. <laughs> I did it though. I beat the game. <laughs> I mean, fair enough. <laughs> the murder will. The murder fox did in fact murder me. <laughs> Gave me the you're an idiot. <laughs> that was good. That was a fun game. Took me way longer to complete than it should have, but you know, no twist ending. It is just straight up. Well, you just jumped into the murder. I thought we were gonna skip into the sunset, dude. What happened? I thought I could trust you. He just had such a trusting face. Aw, the smiley face. <laughs> I'm gonna- when I edit the video, I'm gonna put the fucking the Seinfeld sound effect. <laughs> the Sight Lucy. <laughs>